Hello there, lords and ladies. Danny Stewart again from BaseJapanDirect.com with another Naked Sound review. I've been hoping to get around to doing this uh, review in a long uh, in a long while, actually. I've had this in stock for a while. I've just been really busy. Uh, this is Dragonfly. Uh, Fat J5. Actually, it's not a J5. It's a PHB5. Fat PHB5. Um, 330 because it's a 33 inch scale um, so medium scale um, jazz bass in very lightweight ash um, power ferro fretboard matching headstock high grade gotto tuners high grade gotto bridge is the 404 um, is this the SJ I think this is the SJ so it's a steel uh, it's the steel one um, with the steel saddles um, and uh, it's got uh, the pickups are wood encased um, they're encased in a beautiful um, I think this is walnut but it's dark very very dark um, I think it's stained um, almost looks uh, it could even be ebony um, hard to tell but whatever it is it's dark wood encased it's real wood, it's not just a veneer, it's solid um, solid wood uh, casing there, um, so very high grade stuff. Um, and this is all done in-house at their small workshop. Um, so it's got their onboard preamp here, which is very powerful. I'm um, having to keep the, the amp here in the room uh, at a fairly low volume because otherwise, other, uh, otherwise this will uh, do it over. Um, so I was balanced there just with everything dialed up. very powerful uh, if I take the uh, the mid down to notch and perhaps uh, this is a coil tap switch by the way this is that's a mid switch that's a coil tap switch for the, the humbucker if I flip that up you'll get more of a um, you'll get, just get the rear coil um, operating so Strings also nice. Um, of course, it's uh, if I play with uh, a lot of velocity, uh, the little PJB here is not handling it too well. Um, but um, yeah, it, it, it you know it'll bring the house down. Uh, you get get on a big rig with one of these, it just sounds absolutely phenomenal. Um, it's beautiful stuff. Um, so yeah, you've got all these tonal controls, cut notch and boost on your three band EQ here on the, the, the Dragonfly DFB3. You've got master tone. You've got, um, that's your, uh, that's also a, um, a bypass pull switch on the master tone there. So you can have true passive mode. Um, which is a great feature of the Dragonfly circuit. Um, and then that's your mid switch over there. So let's go on the rear now. So the rear pickup, let's, let's just have uh, the mid boosted and treble cut and the uh, master tone down because uh, Oh, God, that's beautiful. And then if I go uh, full coil, 
wheels on the rear pickup. situation doesn't it really um, I think it sound it's just one of the ultimate rear pickup sounds um, on any of the the builds um, that I have over here I mean I did the Suto yesterday and I, I loved the sound of that but for me this is even better um, and you've still got the treble there uh, if you want to add that on the switch in the up position down position it, it becomes warmer and thicker um, so yeah it's just vast the tone scope is just incredibly um, wide on this thing let's go on the front pickup um, let's just have uh, the bass have the mid switch on This is in a more or less a traditional P bass um, positioning in terms of where it lies uh, distance wise from the end of the neck. Um, let's just have a listen to the front pickup. Um, we'll play that groove from earlier and um, let's, uh, yeah, we'll have the mid switch on. Master tone cut, treble cut, everything else turned up bass. Yeah. So that's nice and uh, big, fat, and round. For a 33-inch scale bass, uh, the B string is is nice. It's nice and uh, reliable, even at this uh, low action. Um, so now I've got the tone up. I've got everything dialed up. In fact. Um,
So yeah, so much tonal scope. Uh, we haven't even gone into the passive mode, but um, passive mode. Um, of course, the uh, the rear pickup still has uh, the coil tap feature in operation. So yeah, I mean even uh, passive mode is very nice. Of course, um, coil tap off. Uh, sorry, in the up position, which is uh, parallel. Um, yeah, I mean it sounds good. Um, passive too, if that's what you want. Um, if that's how you want to use it. Um, that is also fine. You've got a genuine um, passive jazz bass setting there. Um, so yeah, very, very versatile, very lightweight, this one. Um, and uh, just the ultimate, I think, yeah, I mean, rear pickup and balance sound is, is just, uh, it's the ultimate for me. Um, balanced uh, with the uh, parallel mode and with the yeah yeah so um especially the rear pickup sound on this is just so nice and it's a very organic sounding bass this one is um a nice lightweight body um it sort of breathes you know um so if, if you're looking for that um really tight punch um it's not really the instrument for you because um let's just check that out again balanced <laughs> yeah it's still it's, it's quite breathy because of the So yeah, I thoroughly recommend it if you're looking for a really, really nice, uh, versatile, but um, natural, a sort of organic sounding um, instrument. Um, this is this is it. It breathes, it's very lively, it's got life. Um, when you play it, it feels like it's responding to you, you know. Whereas when you get on more modern, well, it is a modern jazz bass, but when you get on things like uh, like the Moon um, that I, I reviewed yesterday uh, back there, the uh, Suto or the um, the DJB, they're more kind of um, they're not so organic. They're they're uh, more sort of glassy, transparent sounding things. Um, whereas this is, uh, you know, it's got that natural warmth and breath that's what i want to say um so if you like that this is the base for you if you prefer that really modern punch a glassy punch then it's not 
Um, so there you go, guys. That'll do it. Thanks for watching another Naked Sound review. And this bass is available as linked below. And if you like that riff, um, check out the short I, that I'm going to do about it. Um, and also check it out on my Patreon page where I'll do a slightly longer video about that little riff uh, and the technique used um, for Patrons. All right. Cheers, guys. See you again soon.